What up, 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 world? It's your boy Amp Dog with another episode of Politicking. Want to thank everybody for tuning in, showing your love, and uh, make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend. Big Amp Dog said, What's the deal? And today we got a story about um, porn star Ron Jeremy has been indicted on more than 30 counts of sexual assault in involving 21 women over the past two decades. Jeremy is accused of sexually assaulting the women over a 23-year span between 96 and 2019, according to the district attorney's office in Los Angeles. The victims range the victims range in age from 15 to 51. Gee, Louise. Uh, Jeremy pleaded not guilty to 12 counts of forcible rape, 7 counts of forcible oral copulation, 6 counts of sexual battery by restraint, 4 counts of sexual penetration by foreign object, 2 counts of sexual penetration of an unconscious or asleep person, and 1 count each of lewd act upon a child under the age of 14, 15, sodomy by use of force and assault with intent to commit rape, the district attorney said. His position is the same as when the criminal complaint was filed. Oh, that's his attorney. Uh, he's innocent of all charges is what his attorney is saying. Um, a grand jury returned the indictment August 19th, and it was unsealed Wednesday. That comes nearly after a year after the charges, a year after Jeremy was charged <clears throat> with more than 30 counts. Wow, so... Dang, that's crazy. Well, I'll be real with you. This answers a lot of my questions I had as a child growing up. Like, seeing this dude with some of, like, the, you know, the top, I guess at that, I guess it was Instagram models before Instagram. You know, like the like the porn stars and stuff. You know, Jennifer, uh, I don't know her name. <laughs> I forgot they she old as fuck too. But she used to be with this little rock and roll dude. I forgot his name. Dang, that's messed up. I can't think of her name because she was popping. She was like a Baywatch beauty or something like that. But yeah, he used to hang around them type of caliber of women and I used to be like, damn, like like it don't matter what you look like, your shape, nothing. Like just certain people that got it. And I thought he was one of them people, but clearly it shows that he was doing a lot more than just being able to uh, book a, a pretty model or stripper for uh, a, a porn scene. Um, it's unfortunate um, as hell. And the fact that you, like, you got all these beautiful women that you were dealing with. And this is how you know something psych psychologically not right with this dude, right? Because you got all these different women that you didn't deal with. Beautiful women, right? Porn stars women that men drool over right and you still find or still have an urge to mess with a child that's where it's like these motherfuckers is mentally ill and there's a special place for you ron jeremy um i mean all, i mean real 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 talk bro you lived a you lived a, a great life from with most guys we're under the impression of, but I'm sure that's probably going to change when they see that, damn, this motherfucker was out taking it. He was really forcing these women, like, all this stuff that he's charged with, from the uh, forcible oral copulation, the penetration by foreign object, it's like, this motherfucker was really living a porn movie scene, like a porn scene. Like, that's what it seemed like. Um, it just, unfortunately, you need consent, sir. You need to make sure you got consent of the, the, the other party. Um, and you got to make sure they have, they have, but they are up age. Um, yeah, well, yeah, this is similar to the, the media mogul Harvey Weinstein. So that they probably ran in the same circles. I will not doubt it. You know what I'm saying? Cause if you've seen what Harvey Weinstein looked like, Outside of you knowing he got a he he's a billionaire or whatever, you know what I'm saying? It'd be hard to try to understand what a woman would see into these type of dudes, you know what I'm saying? So unfortunately for Jeremy, uh, whose real name is Jeremy Hyatt, um, he's sixty eight years old. And um, yeah, bro, like you're an icon in the ent entertainment industry, but I think you need to I think they need to th throw you out the raptors just because of this. Now 
you are uh, innocent until proven guilty. And maybe you are a part of one of these uh, targeted white male um, targets like a Harvey Weinstein. But at the end of the day, I do feel like something just telling me something just telling me deep down that you guys more than likely was doing this kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's no different than, you know, uh, R. Kelly, right? R. Kelly is trying to play the whole, oh, they trying to put a black man down. But then when you see certain things, um, you can see that a lot of times these are true. You know what I'm saying? Even, even Brother Polite, you know what I'm saying? Like, these dudes are out here defending um, uh, forcible, forcible, forcible actions against, you know, unwanted um, people. Like, these people are not consenting to deal with you, have sex with you, anything like that. And you guys are taking it a step further by forcing it. Um, you know, 12 counts of forcible rape. That's crazy. Um so I feel like just the fact that, you know, you could watch an R. Kelly interview with a 15-year-old Aaliyah and just the demeanor why like, these motherfuckers walk out on stage matching outfits. You know what I'm saying? So I do believe that, yeah, it was probably the nature in the time back in the day, um, the 80s and uh, early 90s or whatnot. But at the end of the day, right is right, wrong is wrong. And um, this is one of them situations where, what you do in the dark will come to the light. And that's why I'm not feeling too bad about a lot of these celebrities that's going through what they're going through. Because could you imagine, um, could you imagine a fucking Charlemagne um, in the prime of his, of his radio career? Before anybody knew about all this stuff, the allegations and the, the charges, the lesser charges. Like, could you imagine how much of a monster and a dick these people was? Like, we see a lot of it that's audio and video footage of Charlemagne doing like way out perverted stuff, like having inappropriate conversations with mindless behavior. You know what I'm saying? Like, like just promoting this rape culture. And so, um, I don't feel bad for none of you guys. Um, Ron Jeremy, you old, um, just go ahead and live your final days, you know, um, you know, in that special place. Um, the way you look in these photos, 68, I mean, I don't know what God got in store for you, but you know, you might be here another one or two of those, you know, who knows? But, um, yeah, um, y'all drop y'all comments down below, like, share, subscribe. Tell me what y'all think. Um, are these guys being targeted? Are they being set up? Is it somebody behind the closed doors that's hating on him? Like, oh, he had, he had this girl. He had that Baywatch, honey. He had this. And y'all let me know what's that girl's name, uh. She used to be with like, like Travis Barker or some Parker Barker. She used to be with one of the rock and roll dudes. No, dang, I can't even think. I don't even know. I don't even know his name. But he real popular. They was they was real popular. Pamela Anderson is that her name? Pamela Anderson. <laughs> I think I got it. I think I got it. But yeah, like that's the type of type of um, women these guys were around to where I don't see why you would need. A, a 14 or 15 year old child and I don't see why in the fuck you would need to try to forcibly take anything away from whether they're 14 15 or like they said 51 years old you know what I'm saying like that's somebody's grandma at that point you know what I'm saying I was I hope they got grandkids that it you know come molly wop your ass you know what I'm saying um but yeah you know I, I, I'm seeing that it's about to be a lot more uh a lot more of these celebrities joining joining them prison systems and um and they're gonna be all under the same title you know what i'm saying and y'all gonna all have to be in that pc because this kind of stuff these kind of charges they don't they don't rock with that you know what i'm saying um uh, so yeah the ron jeremy's of the world the charlemagne's the the brother polites the r kelly's harvey weinstein's um all you fellas you know, um, I don't know. Y'all need to get y'all shit together allegedly because right now y'all getting, y'all got some serious things that, that just, right now it's going un unseen a lot. Like, nobody's really speaking about it. Nobody's really in the uproar. But, you know, me, like I always tell you, I'm always for the babies, the women, the elderly. You know what I'm saying? Shit, even us men, you know what I'm saying? But a lot of times, you know, men, 
we got we got to do the brunt of, of of holding up and holding down. You feel me? So I don't really, you know, I mean, stay safe out there, men. But this is really about the babies, the women, and the and the elderly. You know, what I'm saying, making sure that they, the ones that can't protect themselves, are protected. You know. Um, so yeah, y'all just drop y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all think about this because I think this is crazy. Um, that's a lot of charges. Um, and now, like I said, me seeing, like all these years, me seeing him and how he was around all these different women. And, and he always came off like a real pervert to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think I seen him on a Howard Stern show or something like, and he just came off real perverted. And then it's like, it answered a lot of questions when I seen this list of charges. Like, oh, so he really wasn't just getting this shit thrown at him. He was taking it. But anyway, y'all like, share, subscribe. Tell a friend and tell a friend. Big Amp Dog said, what's the deal? Peace.